reservation in Andhra Pradesh. This is the reservation percentage in Andhra Pradesh. Last year, if you look at it, the reservation uh, was around uh, 13, 20 percentage for SC candidates. Uh, uh, sorry, uh, it was around uh, 15 percentage for SC candidates. That has been split now as 6.5, 7.5 and 1 percentage for SC1, SC2 and SC3. This is a recent change through a GEO. Recently, this has been implemented in MBBS as well. SC Group 1, SC Group 2 and SC Group 3 split is there. Rest of it is split accordingly uh, and uh, based on 50 percentages, you are open. No UWS reservation as of now. 5 percentage horizontal reservation as per PWD candidates and one third of seats are reserved for women candidates. So that is female reservation is available. You will be able to see the seats mentioning F female or FAM. Now, in-service reservation. Uh, see, basically, there has been a change here too. After a, uh, after a, uh, after in-service candidates represented, last year these numbers were changed. This year they have gone back to the original uh, rule. Fifteen percentage of clinical seats in these specialities alone will be available for in-service candidates because there is a need in these specialities is what the department uh, mentions. So they 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 are available for in-service candidates and 30 percentage non-clinical seats are reserved for in-service candidates across all specialties. So 15 percentage is in only these specialities are available. Last year this was 20 that was being modified and for an in-service candidate they should uh, to be eligible for in-service seats two years uh, in tribal area or two years in rural area or six years in health services etc. AB uh, PVP or AP insurance or university of health sciences you should have completed. No incentive marks are added. Only seats are reserved. These many seats are only for in-service candidates exclusive for them. In-service candidates are eligible only for in-service seats. They are not eligible for uh, non-service seats. They will not come in and compete in the rest of the seats. Uh, they should have leftover service of 10 years and should not have completed a PG degree already. If you have completed a PG diploma, then you might be able to do it only in the same specialty and depending upon whether you have already done a PG diploma through in-service or not, the number of years you can do a PG diploma also varies and if a uh, degree also varies. If the candidate does not join service within 10 years, then the entire tuition fee and any other emoluments that you have gotten will have to be given back. Post completion, 10 years service is required. A penalty of 10 lakhs is applicable otherwise. Reservation is only for local candidates. It's not for other candidates. So uh, basically, you can't get reservation being another candidate. You should be an AP candidate.